Christ the King wasn't born in a palace, didn't have wealth or servants, and had no interest in power or popularity. Christ the King befriended the lowly and marginalized, saved the sick and sinners, eventually went willingly to a violent and God-forsaken death on the cross. In our lives as Christians who recognize the reign of this backwards king, we must take up our crosses and live radical sacrificial lives of servanthood, compassion, inclusivity and humility, rejecting the false idols of celebrity, ideology and the self. Mm -hmm.